What's up, people? I'm going to give my take on this whole Black Panther movie. I didn't see the movie, but I've seen clips. And uh, just from seeing the clips and the reactions and the reviews, what I gather from this Black Panther movie is that it has proven that black people have low self-esteem. It also has proven that the white man is your God. And it also has proven that black people will spend frivolously. And everybody just comes and make money off the black people. Just give them that false sense of hope. Give them that false hope like Barack Obama did and they'll be in your corner. You see, after the movie came out, black people started praising, you know, the cast, and they're out there saying, see, see, black people can spend money, see, the, 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 black, the, black, um, the black money is powerful. The black money is powerful. But, but powerful for who? Not you. Because when you spend, you take money from yourself or your communities and it goes right into another community, right into the hands or the pockets of somebody else. In which it goes right back into the bank accounts of the people that you call white supremacists. You complain about these white supremacists, but then you spend all your money just to see yourselves on a movie screen and all the money goes right back into the white supremacist pocket because they're the ones who created and produced the Black Panther character and stories. And then I see people out here trying to prove to people and try to reaffirm to people that, hey, see, black people can spend. We, we broke box office records. Make more black movies. Because you're appealing to your God that, hey, you can get more of our money while you leave the black communities in ruin. You've already proven yourselves with all this weave buying, with all this Jordan buying, space jams and all of that. And it also proves that black people have symbolisms. They just want to see themselves on the movie screen. There's nothing wrong with seeing um, black actors and stuff, but we're acting as if, I see people acting as if it's the coming of Christ. Just to see black people on the movie screen. Black people have been on the movie screen for years. Have you heard of Sidney Poitier and these guys? Red Fox and... and, and, and um, Bill Cosby and them. We're acting like Black Panther, you know, is the first we've ever seen black people on, on, on TV or on movie screens. I don't care if it's an all-black cast. We have seen black people on movie screens before, but it's our low self-esteem. And because of our low self-esteem, we end up losing money. Because it's the low self-esteem of our women, why these Koreans are making so much money, in the weave industry. Now the movie industry is about to make a whole lot more money because of the black people's low self-esteem. Because they're just dying to see black people on TV screens and movie screens. So they're willing to go into movie, the movie theaters and spend a whole bunch of money wearing dashikis. And the thing is a lot of these people, they're not going back to Africa. They call Africans African booty scratchers. Some people don't even want to be attached to Africa. But they're wearing dashikis at the movies. I mean, the Black Panther has proven that a lot of black folks are idiots. And that's all I have to say.